uh, Professor Liu is going to use this video to show you how to open uh, Java API uh, document. In any browser, you just type AP, uh, Java API uh, as do A, okay, newer one. So just type like that. And the first uh, pop up link will be your Java API. All right. So on the left hand side are all classes. Okay. So let's take a look. Uh, the class we use very often is alphabetic order. So let's go to string. Um, so string. All right. So this is the way you study. You you learn this. Okay. So you will see. It tell you string is a class. Okay, a brief uh, a brief introduction. For example, if you want to do a string, the data type string, and create a variable str and uh, initialize it. Okay. Then let tell you the field constructor. Constructor is how you initialize a uh, string object. Uh, you can leave it blank. You can give bytes. So we're going to teach you how to do this in the future. Now you also need to learn important thing like a, a method. Method are specific um, actions. For example, a string will allow you to compare, compare string to string, compare one string to another string. On the left hand side, tell you what is a return data type. If you say integer, then you must create a variable integer type, and the result will return to this integer. If you you see the re, uh, re, return data, data type is string, you must create a variable as a string data type, and you use this variable and uh, to uh, return to a string. Okay, very often we use will be equal. Uh, we also use uh, very often is index of. We look for one special character like a space, and we find out return to an integer in index integer. So where you find this? Okay, probably dollar sign something. All right, it's empty. And also, you very very often we use is length. If your character, if your password is only twenty. Uh, length is twenty. It, it will uh use this to control. You give e, a user can provide the right uh length among the right amount of length. You can do replace. Very often, then uh we can do substring. Okay, two string, two lower case, two upper case. Those are very very popular uh action. You want to use, right? So in order to do this, in order to do this, all right. So you must create a class like this, string as str e a b c. So after that, only str the object, only the object can retrieve the method. So like this, what you will say is str da child at str da co point at. And depend on you have a char your return data type. If you have return data type, you are going to have a return data type on the left hand side. All right. So for example, right here. For example, right here, um, I have a string. Alright, so uh, for example, right here, I have a string. Alright, so what I'm going to do is this. Okay, so I will do the data type string. Uh, your object is river, string, river. 
and initialize to Mississippi. Then the river will be allowed, not stream, the river. Only the object is allowed to retrieve the method. The way to retrieve method is dot notation. So river dot to uppercase. They will change to all uppercase. Then another thing is if you want to use others is you know greeting that's object da length use da notation to get the method and for example replace and river da replace so this is how you are going to this is uh uh the this is uh your java api document it's a very important document uh i usually call this java bible so if you are familiar with this Java Bible, you can actually write uh, Java programming by yourself. I hope uh, this video helps you.